Maybe the best journeys have never been about going further, but about going deeper. I'm looking for an opportunity to travel back to Jamaica. It's where I was born and spent much of my childhood. So when my friends invited me there, I was in. Ian, Henry and Sam were intrigued by an old legend. There's a mystical location in Jamaica known by locals as Nonsuch Falls. As some doubt its very existence, that's what we're going to try and find. We rented a remote cabin in Portland to map out our trip. Portland is a little explored parish and happens to be the home of Jerk. When you're there, make sure you head to the Boston Jerk Center. Head down to Boston from Port Antonio and trust me, you'll smell the smoky flavors before you even see it. Having that jerk again took me straight back to memories of my childhood. My dad used to say, feel the place man, feel it. Back then I would spend countless hours at the Blue Lagoon close by with my family. Most people explore near the shore but if you take a boat across, you'll find a big almond tree with a swing rope attached. I used to think I'd seen all of Jamaica, every parish, but none such had me questioning that. After a few days, we swapped our jungle cabin for great huts to search a different area of the parish. It's a special place, built to honor our ancestry and cultural heritage. Here we found an old travel guide that talked about Nonsuch Falls. Apparently, it can only be accessed if you hike deep into the forest and follow a river upstream. We searched for hours, and of course, we got lost in the jungle. Eventually, we started stopping locals and asked for the precise location. Every person we asked said, Nonsuch. Nonsuch don't have no falls. They assured us it did not even exist. So we woke up the next day, we caught sunrise and we took a dip in the warm Caribbean sea. We headed into Boston to a colorful wooden bar and we met Farmilia, who over a heated game of dominoes let on that we could find the mysterious falls. We went a couple of miles past Zion Hill before heading deep into Sherwood Forest. The deafening roar of Nonsuch was strong. We knew we were close by. And there it was. This majestic secret towering hundreds of feet. Buried deep in the forest like a relic from a lost world. Sometimes you have to let yourself get caught up in all the stories and swept away by moments you just could not have planned. Perhaps the real secret of Nonsuch is that it taught us the best journeys have never been about going further, but instead about going deeper. <laughs>